welcome back. Uh, okay, before we begin, before we begin, uh, make sure you guys do check the description below. Um, we do have a very good VPN called Provado, Provado VPN, really good stuff. Now they do have a free option to try out. I've been telling everybody, get the one year deal. The one year deal is where it's at the, the one, the free it's, it's, it limits what you get, 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 get the paid version guys. I'm telling you, get the annual one in the description below. You guys will be able to see that now. Okay. If you have the new uh, 4K uh, or the Fire Stick 4K Max, I don't even know what the hell we're calling this thing. Fire Stick 4K Max, I think, or Fire TV, I don't know, whatever. Let's just jump into this thing here now. These are the settings you need to turn off today. Now, here, here is the, here's the reason why. If you come up here at the top, you do get some, you know, a few advertisements. Sometimes this stuff does play. If you come down here towards uh, one down, you do get a little sponsorship right there. And sometimes some of these things will just start playing and it's pretty loud and annoying. So this is what we're going to do. We're going to go to the far right to that little gear icon. That's going to be your settings. Now you want to come down here towards the bottom and a couple things you want to do so uh, a couple things here so the first thing we want to do is notifications click on this if you have anything new it's going to tell you here it says click on the three but or the three lines which we call it also the hamburger button that's also your options click on that you're going to see a little settings click on settings now notification settings do not interrupt turn on to hide all application notification pop-ups or you could block uh, just certain ones. I don't want to see like something that's notifying me like, hey, turn this, like, you know, the pop-ups, all the pop-ups, get rid of that, turn, like, turn it on. Um, I don't, I don't want to see the pop-up notifications. If you're going to do an update, if you're going to do whatever, just do it. Leave me alone. Okay, now the next thing is, let's just say you want to add a, uh, like a parental control. So that way, if you have a guest and people start purchasing stuff, you don't want that to happen. Go to account and profile settings. Now from here, come down to parental controls. And this is where you'll be able to turn this on. If you want to add some codes, that's how you're going to do it. Um, profiles, if you want to do that too, you can, you can manage your profiles. Now, okay display and sounds now we're going to come here to display now the next thing we're going to do is we're going to come down here to preferences now preferences has a lot of stuff here so you also got your parental controls if you want to turn that on privacy settings device usage data this uh this okay so use personal data collected by operating system from this device for marketing and for um product improvement purposes you want to turn all this stuff off you don't want them capturing anything so this like collapse app usage data so anything that you're using with the apps allows app store to collect information on the frequency and duration of use of downloaded apps turn that off interest based ads again this looks exactly everything that you're doing and watching and whatever what it'll do is they'll grab that information and that's how they sell your information they send it out and if anybody wants to put a bid to put a specific ad there you go data monitoring also off data monitoring consumption on your amazon fire tv stick max so turn that off now the next thing is uh notification settings again we did that before do not interrupt turning that on because i don't want any kind of apps featured content allow video autoplay off allow audio autoplay off turn that off that's that's all the stuff that automatically plays and everything um sometimes it blasts and it's super loud you want to turn all that stuff off because that just that for one that takes ram that takes some a little bit of memory as it's caching some of the data stuff in there you just want to turn all that stuff off now down here, sync recent content. If you want to turn this off, I leave this on, but if you have, uh, th so this includes prime video titles watched on other devices in the recent row on this device. So what that does is if you're somewhere else watching whatever on your Amazon prime, and then you decide to come to a different TV, this will show your recent. So I leave this on 
obviously I'm in the same house. So if I'm upstairs watching something, I want to go downstairs and finish watching it. Then I just, I, I don't want to go searching for it. So this will be your recent now. Now, a couple of things too, is you do have your, my fire TV, um, and you do have your developer options. Now, some of this stuff, people turn this on if they want to allow to download applications. So if you turn it on, does that install unknown apps downloader i have it turned on if i want to install other apps pretty simple and pretty basic now down at the bottom you could reset or restart your fire stick which is good has a lot of different features there if you want to do equipment control you come here and this is how you could sync your tv so equipment control automatic this will let the fire tv fire tv will not be able to control your equipment so if you don't want the fire tv to control your tv turn it off um, I leave it automatic so that way it can control it, manage equipment, fine tune how Fire TV controls your TV, audio, and other equipment. So you could go here and add an equipment. You could do the TV, you could do the Fire TV, and you could do the advanced settings too. So wanted to make this video pretty short so that way you guys get the gist of it. Um, most of this stuff you're going to want it off, a few things you're going to want it on, but um, wanted to throw that out there <laughs> like warning. And I'm glad I actually did some of that stuff because, man, it gets loud. Some of that featured content, yeah, it's, you know, I get it. They want to advertise some stuff, but, man. So, hope you guys have found this. Uh, hope you guys have found some stuff here for some a couple tips and tricks that you guys could use. Uh, make sure you guys share the video. This is some stuff that if you do have a Fire Stick, and, it, and it's not just a Fire Stick Max. You could do this on the regular Fire Stick 4K. You could do this on the Fire Stick Lite and the third gen fire stick and even some of the older devices so there it is right there let me know in the comment section below what you think hopefully you guys have found this uh video entertaining and educational and yeah with all that being said you guys take care take care of each other and i'll see you guys on the next one take care guys Bye.